Yeah, right, what up? Good deeds What's he done? are not always rewarded. Uh, and wrongdoings are not oh. always judged in this life. The world is truly a wretched. Oh. But you don't have to worry. Nothing that happens comes with any certainty. In the end, it's all left to mere destiny. Okay. I'll protect your destiny. So please come into this world full of strength, my adorable little. Cece, why don't we visit the lake? It's been a while. Yes, let's do just that. But don't bring any alcohol with you, okay? I won't. I haven't had a drink today. It's really been such a long time since we went out like this, hasn't it? Yeah. The background makes it more like a swamp than anything. Come on. Give me your hand. Are you okay? Yes. Pisto, do you think we could start all over again? For the sake of our future child? Yeah. We still need a name for the baby. It's a girl, right? If they say yes. Nachiru, I'm gonna throw hands. She'll be our little girl. You can choose. If her they name. say Nachiru or Eureka, I'm gonna throw hands. What do you think? It's an old friend's name. One the fact that we don't hear heart. the fucking name. Yeah, <laughs> that's a good name. I'm sure. Huh? Bisto, the boat's filling with water. A hole. There's a hole in the boat. Did he do this? We must plug it up. No, oh, it's filling too quickly. So it seems. Huh? Pisto? How will we swim to shore? It's too far. I, I can't make it. But I... No. It saps all my strength away. Why does it sap your strength? It's impossible for me to get across this lake. Anti-magic lake? Pisto, we must do something. At this rate, we'll... Yes. We will. Cece, let's put an end to all of this. How long will this suffering last? When will you finally forgive me? Please, just let me go already. Bisto, your memories... Cecilia! Hey! Cecilia! Did she use her memory magic on him? Uh, thank goodness! Are you alright? Th this is... <coughs> My maid found the two of you as you were drowning. What about Bisto? Why oh, is it covered in blood? <laughs> Wait a minute, what happened? Why? Why did this happen? <laughs> Why? Why me? Why? 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 <laughs> Got questions. <laughs> Got questions. A couple of them, in fact. I guess we'll find out in 38 hours. I say 38 hours because every fucking section takes at least like 40 hours to complete. And we're already like sort of through it already. So we'll see. Sixty goddamn floors, okay. 
60 goddamn floors so far. I know there's over 100. Ugh. All his paintings have been there was over 100 in the last one as well. Like, Jesus. Yes, that's right. It seems Bisto did all this while I was absent. I was out looking for him when I found you. Bisto did this? Yes. But I haven't the slightest idea as to why he'd do such a thing to his own works. Let's leave it at that. You need to get some more rest. It's too soon for you to be up and about. As long as you're alive, we can start anew. Goodness. Look at all these white slabs. I heard artists were eccentric. But for him to do this to all the paintings in the manor... What's important is that you do something about that dead cat out front. I get queasy just thinking about it. Oh, the one the Marquis killed? You need to get used to it. You know he thinks of children and animals oh as pests to art. But I can't believe he'd actually kill a cat. As a maid, you're still green. Look, it's dark now. I I'll take care of it tomorrow. Honestly, kids these days. I'm sorry. She used necromancy on fucking noir. Off you go. Is that why we can possess noir? Because it's technically a magic construct. Eh, fair enough, I guess. Still, I thought the Marquis couldn't be moved by any woman. I can't believe that old hag is the one that caught his eye. I knew he was strange, but I didn't think he was that strange. Did you know? I heard he hinted to that artist about something going on between the two. Apparently that's why the artist started to lose his mind. The poor man. She hasn't had it easy either. Her husband drank himself into a watery grave. She almost drowned herself and had a miscarriage to boot. Okay. Ugh, well. Right. It was a whole thing too, since she was such a mess. She was in the dungeon for almost 10 days. I couldn't sleep through all the screaming. She couldn't even hold a proper funeral either. Oh, but I saw her in the graveyard the other day. It was really creepy. Ah, <sighs> she's calmed down now, but who knows when she might lose it again. Is she gonna do the same to the baby that she did to the cat? Cause that'd be kinda of fucked up, man of mine on front. That'd be kinda of fucked up. Like, don't do that. <laughs> don't do that. Time for a fair fight! Through them 
Ella. Another one. Eh, dodge it. No, no, ha. Yeah, piling off. I slipped up. What's really paid off? <laughs> well, well, well. This part of the game has no reason to go on for this long, but it do be. Oh, it do be. Well, yes. You'd be able to pay off your debts if you sell the apartment, but that would decrease the income for your household. Wait, what does the apartment have to do with the income? I'd like to Was she renting the it? Debt before it gets any larger. Why don't you take this opportunity to sell your store as well? 
Didn't your father give you permission to? Yes, but it won't be enough to pay off the debt. Besides, it once belonged to my great-grandfather. But it isn't as though you get many customers. I don't think you'll earn much money relying on requests from folks in the neighborhood. Your father is such a stubborn old man. You have medical bills to pay and school fees coming up. Wouldn't it be better to keep the apartment for a steady stream of income? I assume we're renting the apartment. I hate to be rude, but you should be aware you're quite, you know, ugly. It's hard Ooh. enough for a woman to find a job, much oh, less okay. I mean, like we know you. he's a creepy rapist, so like, yes, okay, but, but still, damn. I'm sure a factory might take me on as a worker or something. I know Nachiro will be scared silly if debt collectors start sniffing around. But enough of that. <sighs> if you're so insistent on it, then so be it. I'll go and fetch the documents. Huh? Ah, Miss Colbert, how did your matchmaking meeting go? About that. Not well, I take it? No. He was a very lovely man. Boy, I wonder. But he decided I wonder not why. to pursue it any further. I understand you want to bring your old dad peace of mind by settling down, but I know it must be difficult. No, he's already given up. I'm the one who hasn't. But I love my daughter more than anything. I'm sure my dates can tell she's my top priority. <sighs> that is quite the pickle. I don't think that's I don't think that's what the kid will take away from that. That's uh That's just me. But I don't think that's what the kid will take away from that. I I don't know. <laughs> I am really getting to the end of my rope with this fucking dungeon. I am losing my mind. Oh. Yes, I'm fine now. Please feel free to go. Very well, madam. I shall take my leave. Oh, Cecilia. Everything's fine. You have nothing to worry about. Thank you. What did the thieves take? The investigation is still ongoing. But everything you made and the 26 Curio are still accounted for, thankfully. I see. I'm glad to hear that. Yes. Considering how much time and money I put into my Curio collection, jewels are nothing in comparison. Even so, it appears you'll need to increase your security. I wouldn't be surprised if they steal the Curio next. I will never allow them to be stolen! Hmm, I'll think of something myself as well. What we should do is create a labyrinth. <laughs> I appreciate your assistance in safeguarding the Curio. But what are these peculiar patterns? I inscribed magical crests onto Galeria Manor in order to turn it into a giant gallery. This is a special barrier that absorbs magic. It will create a powerful force field, even in this plane where mana is sparse. Huh? What does that have to do with turning it into a gallery? Patience. This is merely the first step of my plan. Next, I shall use this field to... I... I see. But why have you dismissed all of the maidservants? Come with me. It feels as though the very air within the manor has changed somehow. Yes, it's still rather weak at the moment, but the mana within the manor is growing. It will be gradual, but I expect a powerful field of mana to form inside over time. I will then use that field to go further underground, in order to house the gallery itself. A secret gallery created just for you, filled with works of art that cannot be removed. An expanding labyrinth that can never be infiltrated. You're saying you can use magic to build such this a feels like a massive even leap. further below ground than the basement we're in now? 
I shall use the magic that this was like a massive plan. leap from just a random ass burglary that happened. From there. I like if the Marquis requested this, I understand, but, but for you, you to go out and do this, this is ground. strange. It won't be a secret if we are to employ laborers. How do you intend to address that? You are correct, my lord. I have created a few autonomous Manania to expand underground and work on construction. I call them the Galeria Mobile Manania. The... The Galeria Mobile Manania? I don't understand. They are magical beings powered by mana. They will only work underground, and they will automatically repair and replicate themselves. I am sure they will interpret your desires and construct according to your wishes. So you're saying we can construct a labyrinth like the massive tombs of old? Though that intrigues me, I still have my doubts. I understand. Again, this is a massive leap for her. The accumulating mana within the manor is not enough to maintain the labyrinth. What do you suggest, Cecilia? Before I continue, let me ask you this. What do you see the Curio as? I believe they are fragments of the human soul. They serve as proof of human existence. The Curio answer questions posed and speak eloquently of life, if only one cares to listen. That is why they enchant me, and I will spare no expense to acquire them from around the world. Indeed, it is these very curio that maintain the unstable magic of the labyrinth. The ones I have hidden underground will become the 35 pillars required to maintain it. In other words, 35 human souls sacrificed. How many handmaidens? How many handmaidens, by the way, did, you, did we get rid of? However, the labyrinth is a magical place. It will be necessary to use this wardrobe I created in order to travel back and forth. This is the gateway that connects the two worlds. The average human would most likely be overwhelmed by the mana density difference. Uh, overwhelmed? Yes, at least in your current state. By this I mean you will need to fortify your body in order to go into this mana-filled labyrinth. Fortify my body, you say? Adequate compensation is required in order to obtain She's genuinely such a just body. insane. You might consider this a pact with a demon, in fact. She's genuinely insane. Like, all of this, just because this? from a... I mean, Grant also because of all the shit that happened earlier. <laughs> but just to go straight into to this Cecilia? from a, a simple burglary, she like is I'd actually insane. Such a thing. Selling my Again, if the Marquis... Is a small if, he, if he requested this, I fully understand, sure but she came up with this all on her own, you. unprompted, basically. She is wild. Do you see me as a part of your collection as well? <laughs> what harsh words, Cecilia. I love you. I have ever since we first met ten years ago. It's been ten years? Goddamn. Why? Uh, 
What are you trying to do? Depending on your answer, I may never forgive you. <laughs> you won't forgive me, Marquis? What about me? Do you think I didn't know about the lies you told Bisto? What are you saying? Are you trying to kill me for revenge? I could have killed you whenever I wanted, but that isn't my intention. I won't kill you. In fact, I won't ever let you die. Ever. For all eternity, even. You will be reborn into a new body. One that can survive underground. Reborn? What? I don't comprehend any of this. You will be reborn into something more suitable for one so knowledgeable about Curio. You will forever stay underground to construct and protect. <laughs> Never fear. I shall assign a gravekeeper on the surface to take your place. Two foolish men who shall work together happily in order to guard the graves of my beloved children. The, the graves of your... Children? Now, Plural? Forget everything that's happened. Forget it all. Continue to build the gallery of your laughable dreams. For all eternity, labor to create an impenetrable labyrinth. Y you. Oh, is he God? Wicked. No, but we met. We met. He was a stone dude. We met him. Finally, it's over. Please be at peace forever. Another beautiful day today. Again, children, I plural. I believe I've been blessed with a child. Tomorrow will be a full moon. Perhaps I could use a spell to learn more about this baby. Does she have twins? <gasps> Is that what the issue days. was? That it was two babies instead of one? I'll protect your destiny. So please come into this world full of strength. My adorable little... ...are long gone. Mentally, yes. We have established this. You are do. insane. <laughs> and back to the climb we go. Lovely. Again, though, like... Twins? Also, what? <laughs> More fucking questions than answers there. <laughs>